Hi everybody, in this video we're going to make a background color gradient based on two colors, a top color, in this case light blue, and a bottom color which is orange. So let's see how this works. So I've declared two variables, a top color and a bottom color, and in the setup function I've created a canvas, a width and the height of the window, and I've set my top color variable to light blue using the RGB uh, values and I set my bottom color to orange. Okay, so how does this work? How does, how can we tell the program to make a color gradient? So we know the top color is blue and the bottom color is orange. What's gonna happen, we're gonna set up a loop and it's gonna draw one line at a time and it's going to mix the colors from orange to light blue one line at a time. We make a for loop so four, let y equals zero, y is less than the height of the canvas. So we're starting at line zero, and then we're gonna map. So what does map do? So this map function scales a range of numbers. So it's scaling, so it's scaling our y values uh, from zero to height, and we're ma mapping those values from zero to one. So each of these lines of the canvas will have a range from zero to one. Okay, that's what map does, just ranges one range of values to another. And then we're going to set the new color using this lerp color function. So lerp color interpolates or mixes the top color and the bottom color, depending on how close you are or how far away you are from the top color and the bottom color. And the, the mixing color is n, which is the value uh, of the map from zero to one. Okay, so that's what lerp color. Lerp color is mixing the two colors according to a ratio. And then we just change the stroke to that new color. And then we make a line from the left hand side to the right hand side, a horizontal line for each of those colors in that loop. And there's nothing in the draw function. So that's how it works. You're just making a loop for the height of the object. And you're starting from one color and you're using the lerp color to, to mix the colors uh, based on their location. And if you only want a part of the screen, you can change this height part. Instead of height, maybe you just want 100 pixels of it, and we'll have to change it in the map part of it, right? Because the map is mapping the ratio. We don't have any orange in here. I want the whole thing in here. So I got to put the top value as 100 pixels, and it'll map it in here. And that's how you can create a two color gradient in the background uh, on P5.